Hello and welcome back to the Tarantula Cave. In this episode, we're going to talk about my Are you sitting comfortably? Then I'll begin. So, our story starts with the mail that I found in my conservatory uh, several weeks ago now, if not months, and he looked like this. And then, as many of you will know, I already had a female cardinal spider who I caught down the side of my house, and she looks like this. Now, I was desperate to try and breed them because I saw an amazing YouTube video with a different species, um, which is the UK giant house spider, Erotogena atrica, um, which showed the male trying to climb through the, the female's web and, um, and all the drumming, and she came out and they mated and he guarded the eggs, and it was just like so amazing that I thought, yeah, I can do that. I've got these spiders around my house, so why shouldn't I be able to get that footage? But actually what happened was, I put the male in with the female, and she ate him. So, that was awkward. I opened the lid on the uh, enclosure and his legs were on the floor. But, the good news is, she didn't need him anyway. So he did his business and he um, died, obviously. But she made an egg sac um, and out of that egg sac um, there were a few spiderlings came out and they had a few webs inside the enclosure and I'm pretty sure some of them, some of them actually got out of the out of the fornarium and into my fish room so they could be anywhere um, and they look like this. And then one of them molted and it looked like this. And so I thought to myself, yeah, any time now, I'll just take the spiderlings I can find and I'll put them in little vials and they'll have their own little homes and that'll be great. And then I found this. So all that time I've been really hoping to catch footage of the female sitting over her eggs because I noticed that what she did was she laid them in a, in a kind of cup of webbing and she was over the top of them, but then she seemed to wrap them the first time. But then this time, she has had a second clutch of eggs and she had it right out in the open, I think to have them near the water for the humidity. I've got a little water dish in there. Um, but yeah, but they stayed in their little cup and then she webbed over the top of them. So they're basically all sealed in and she's been guarding them for several days now. And I just think it's fascinating. So yeah, it's amazing. So I'm waiting for these eggs to hatch. Hopefully I'll be able to document the process. But I just wanted to share with you guys that I'd actually managed to breed this species um, it was completely by luck that the male did his business or perhaps the female was fertile already and she just needed one delicious male meal to give her enough energy to make the eggs. Um, I don't know, either way, we had spiderlings. I don't know if they, if some of them got out, if the female ate them all to try and reserve energy because she didn't think they were going to make it. Um, but yeah, we'll definitely try and raise a few of these when they hatch. Um, it's a native species, so it's not the end of the world if I lose them anyway, but, um, but hopefully I will get to raise them because I think that will be interesting. And um, watch this space. So that's it, just a short video today. Um, just wanted to update you on the cardinal spider situation. But uh, yeah, as some of you will have noticed, there's a little something on my hat that I need to talk about. And that, my friends, is my ghost mantis, who molted a couple of days ago. And that is good news, because it's getting bigger. I'm pretty sure it's female because it's green, but um, we'll find out. Anyway, I'll probably do a video on this girl at some point. Her name is Pheasant Pie because my little two-year-old named her and he's not great at naming things. So that's a fact. Uh, that's it for this video. It's just a short one, just an update. So if you're new to this channel, I try and post a video every week. Sometimes it's more. This week it was two. 
Um, so if you want to keep watching my videos, please subscribe down below. Please hit the bell icon, which will give you notifications every time I post a video. Uh, follow me on Instagram and stay safe. Thank <music> you.